Hello, today I'm going to be explaining question 21 from the UKMT Junior Maths Challenge 2019. The diagram shows a regular hexagon, PQRSTU, a square, PQVW, and an equilateral triangle, VXW. What is the size of angle XVR? First you need to know that the sum of angles about a point is 360 degrees. So the sum of angles around the point V is going to equal 360 degrees. Therefore, if we find the angle in the equilateral triangle, the angle in the square, and the angle QVR, then we can find the angle XVR. To find the sum of angles in a shape, you use the formula N minus 2 times by 180. Then to find a single angle in that shape, you have to divide by n, where n is the number of sides of the shape. If we start by finding the angle in the triangle, that's going to be 180 divided by 3, so that's 60 degrees. Next, the angle in the square is 360 divided by 4, which is 90 degrees. To find the angle QVR, we first need to find the angle VQR. So the angle VQR is going to be the angle inside the hexagon minus the angle inside the square. And we already know the angle in the square is 90 degrees. And so if we find the angle in the hexagon, that will be 120 degrees. And so 120 take 90 gives us 30 degrees. And so now if you consider VQR as a triangle, you can see that it's isosceles because the side length of the square is the same as the side length of the rectangle. And so that means angle QVR is going to be 180 minus 30 degrees, which gives 150, and then divide by 2. So that's 75 degrees. That means that angle XVR is going to be 360 minus 60 minus 90, minus 75, which leaves us with the answer of D, 135 degrees.